What is up, peeps? FWTV TV HD here, and I'd like to welcome you to another episode of the best in FIFA. In this episode, we are going to be looking at Asamoah, a player that, you know, I say this about most uh, players that I do in the best in FIFA, but again, he's overlooked and kind of ignored as, you know, because people go for like El Sharari or something in the uh, Serie A, and he's, he's, he's just great. He's got like a, he's got all round stats so he can pretty much play anywhere on the pitch in this video I played him as a striker in the left forward variation and uh, yeah played him there and he done very well I did play him as a left forward as well in a 4-3-2-1 formation and that's where I played him mainly you can play him as a left back though you can play him as a centre mid anywhere so there's his card for you he's got 84 pace 82 dribbling 74 shooting 75 passing uh, 82 physical and 69 defending so as I said an all round good stats and he is a god and I mean seriously he is a gem I think he costs it will come up in the video a second now it will cost around about uh, it says price range there 150 minimum to 5,000 maximum but he's usually sells for about 1,200 coins uh, uh, maybe a bit less even he's quite cheap because you know he's a 79 rated player packed a lot and as I said overlooked no one's really giving him any shout outs on YouTube and stuff so he's gonna be cheap and stuff like that by the way just before I kind of get into some extra stuff here what do you think of this new overlay or or layout that I've got for the video where I kind of show you a bit of stats and stuff about him if you don't like it let me know if you do uh, let me know as well in the comments down below or even a like or a dislike one of those ways for telling me that you do like this or not but yes he's five foot ten inches work rates high high which you probably think that's a bad thing as a striker but as long as you give the instructions for him to get in behind the attack and stay forward I think it is or stay central or something like that uh, he will not be out of position much and to be honest I didn't even realize one bit that he was out of position as you can see in this little clip here where he scored he was in position he does make the run so he's definitely good now I love him as a striker I absolutely adore him as a striker his finishing isn't great his long shots are amazing but his finishing isn't great and you kind of have to kind of put yourself in a position where it's quite easy to finish with him sometimes uh, which is a negative but it, uh, it doesn't happen a lot so I do enjoy using him uh, his finesse shots are pretty decent as I said his long shots are absolutely great he's got very powerful long shots he's very hard to tackle when you go on a sprint uh, sprint run with him uh, and his weak foot is okay I mean I think I, I don't think I scored any with his weak foot in this video but I have scored a sum with his video uh, not not in this video so I've scored some with him and it's okay but Go to the left foot, put yourself on the left foot, whatever position you want to play him in. You know, if you want to play him on the right hand side, cut inside and go for finesse shots. If you don't want to play him on the right hand side, you want to put him out on the left, go for the power shots, you know, stuff like that. So he's definitely good. As you can see, they're nice, easy finish. As long as you put him into those positions, he will score you goals. And it's absolutely great. Another good thing is he's very physical, very strong. As you can see there, he kind of lost the ball to Boateng and kind of pushed him out of the way and said, Look, mate, this ball is mine. And he goes and scores and finishes. So he's quite hard to get off the ball. Now, the chemistry style that I kind of played him in. Uh, mostly throughout this video I played him with the marksman so I can up his physical dribbling and shooting because his pace wasn't as needed um, but I did end up putting him in the uh, hunter in the end to see how he played there and he played great in both positions I mean I dribbled a lot more when I had him with the uh, marksman because you know his dribbling was a lot better but uh, with the hunter I've done a lot more you know pace running down and like blocking some people off and it's very good because he's very strong he's okay in the air not the best in the air so try and keep it down though he's got good crossing as you can see there he got a lovely corner to uh, Dumbio who headed it in and he's good at everything in my sense so got a rage quit from that person as well just because of Asamoah he is someone who is just so ignored and I I really don't like it but that's the point of this series is to kind of present to you look some great gems I find uh, and kind of say look these players are great give them a try they're cheap and they're gonna definitely perform for you and that's what I kind of like about FIFA 15 and all FIFAs you know it the rating doesn't really matter as well as the price if you get a player that suits you and plays well he's gonna do the job and it's as simple as that so if you want to play him as a left forward I would usually say play him as an attacking role play him as a striker left forward or left winger if you, you can play him as a left mid and left back if you want to use him for more defensive reasons or a center mid he can do there in seven camel as a left mid so uh, um, he will play well in every single position really so yeah this has been FTW TV HD slap the like button in the face if you enjoyed subscribe for more I really hope you do try this guy out because he is worth it thanks for watching guys and peace